Hey everybody, it's Teacher Amy, and I just wanted to pop on really quick for a really cool um, thing that I discovered about uh, green screening with Cam Twist. And um, so I had been having a lot of issues with trying to um, adjust my green screen so that it was kind of perfect. So I would like, if I moved in or out or close to the screen or far away, that it would kind of like get kind of green on the edges. And I always have problems with this corner over here. I feel like this corner, whenever I move my arms around, there's always like a green shadow over there. Um, but I was also having problems where I would set up the green screen the night before. And um, and then when I went to teach in the morning, I would have to readjust it. And it was really frustrating because the reason I set it up the night before is so that I wouldn't have to readjust in the morning. Well, I figured out that it has to do with my clothes. So I was, I was getting ready, um, setting up the green screen with my pajamas on and then when I woke up in the morning and I put on my orange sweatshirt that I almost always teach in then that was affecting the lighting and the colors that were going on so that was messing up my green screen well I figured out something cool so um let me go up to here so this this in my background um setup over here this is my green for my um for my chroma key now this little box down here that has all these little uh, squares on it you can save the colors okay so before i was having trouble where i would set it and then when i when i opened it in the morning there would be splotches so i would have to go back in and kind of like move this little circle around and like move you know move things around try to make things perfect see there's that that corner over there is always getting messed up so i was so i would find a spot that looked like it was perfect and then all you have to do is hit this one of these little green squares i don't want to do it now because i don't want to mess up my settings but um if you hit one of these little green squares it's going to save this color that is in this square over here which is your chosen color from up here and then that way when i wake up in the morning if anything is weird or, or anything is off i can just hit i know that this one is the button that makes it look really good that's the right color so if i hit that button then i know that when i'm wearing orange that it's going to look perfect and it has saved me a bunch of time for setup in the morning the other thing that you can do is up on the top part of this next to the color wheel there's these like little slider things and you can get the hex color of your um of your background so um so i've actually like written these down just in case um it's it's really a lot easier to just use the squares but if you want to get really precise and use your hex color number um you can figure out like this is the exact color like if this is off by just a digit or a letter um it's going to change the color of of the background so um so you can get your hex color and you can type that in if that's easier for you too so that's just a quick easy way to make sure that your green screen is always going to look perfect like right now i can move in i can move out and my screen is perfect i don't have any weird greenness going on and um, that's because i saved the color that that worked perfectly for me now i have two on here and the reason i have two is because this is the perfect color when i'm wearing orange but this is the perfect color when i'm wearing black which is the other um, shirt that i wear when i'm teaching so um so i have two of them on here and so I know that I won't have to do too much adjusting or really any adjusting as long as I use one of these two colors that I've saved. So a little tip for you and hope you can use it in the future.